hi guys and welcome back to another video my name is DJ Alize if you are new here if you are not welcome back so before we get into this video don't forget to please like comment and subscribe and today's video is going to be a what's in my work bag so this is my bag I have the blush pink this is the small bog bag and okay so this is the blush pink small bog bag i did not get the full size one because this one is a pretty good size um my mom got this for me from dillard's i included it i think in my last vlog so um it was definitely a gift for my birthday and i absolutely love this bag it reminds me of crocs you know because of the holes and you can put gibbets on it um and then just like the feel of it the bottom you know it's got that kind of bottom that are just like the bottom of crux and like i said i love this bag it fits everything that i need in it i'm very a very like minimal kind of person i don't bring my whole life to work i'm not bringing like i don't know i'm not packing for the winter to go to work i'm just bringing what i need i'm not trying to leave anything at work and this bag does what i need and more and also the straps fold down like this which i do a lot at work just makes it easier um so first and foremost i have my clipboard this is old i have had this since nursing school i probably should get a new one but it keeps like all my report sheets in it um and it also keeps just like policy forms or whatever other papers I need holds it in here fits perfectly in there um next I have started bringing books um most people don't know this but I have never ever read the Harry Potter series so I'm literally starting with book one um I'm a slow reader but that's off topic um so yeah I've had this book for like a month I only really read it at work now, outside of work, I should. I probably would be done by now. But, yeah, I keep a book. Um, I literally just got off this morning, so don't mind this bottle of water. But, yeah, I keep a bottle of water. Um, when I'm off, I keep my badge in it. And this has, like, my RN. It also has, like, contact numbers and... A couple other things i'm not going to show you guys the front because it shows exactly where i work hate that and then this is my little badge reel it's like a brain with a little heart um because we test a lot of our babies for ivh with head ultrasounds it just makes sense um then then i keep a claw clip so depending on how I have my hair like obviously right now I wouldn't need it but depending on how I have my hair if I need to put it up really quick clock clip um I usually keep a scrunchie as well which is right here keep a scrunchie because again depending on how I have my hair if I need to put it up because we're going sterile or whatever um I will have that next I keep a bottle of Advil so this bottle of Advil is been with me for a long time um I keep this just in case I get headaches because sometimes I do get headaches at work um if I'm feeling like a little bit under the weather it'll just bring me right back up it's just it comes in the clutch and you never know when you're gonna need it or when one of your co-workers or something is gonna need it as well next there's this little pouch i would take it out but i don't know how to put it back in but it's like a little clear pouch that's in here if you've seen the bog bags and you know that this is in here and i keep like a bunch of miscellaneous things in here that i'm gonna go through with you guys so one of the most important things especially in the icu is chapstick it's very dry and cold and girl you don't want to be going outside so keep chapstick i usually keep two but right now i have one in here I also keep scissors. So 
So these are, I don't know what kind of scissors these are. They're kind of like the suture remover scissors, um, but they come in clutch when you need to cut something and you don't like want to use big bulky scissors. Um, they are a little sharp at the tip, so you have to be careful, but they're slender, so they kind of like, you know, slide under whatever you need it to, especially with babies. The big like bandage scissors is not going to work for them, so... And cutting their little small, you know, dressings or tegaderm, whatever. This is great for that. Next, I keep, like, pencils and pens. Um, this is one of my favorite pens. It's the Staples Sonics Gel Pen. Super dark. Almost looks like a Sharpie. Great pen. Um, I keep two pencils because I like to sometimes take my report in pencils just because... You know, sometimes what you get in report is not always what it actually is. And that way I can erase and kind of put what it actually is. Once I go and look at the patient, I check the chart, I check the orders. This is great to have. Um, next, I will keep colored pens. Don't ask me why this doesn't have a cap. I don't know what happened to the cap. But I do keep colored pens. I have more, but this is the one I have currently in my bag. Like I said, I just got off this morning. Next, I keep a mini Sharpie. You can attach this to your bag, but I don't like having a... Ugh. You can attach this to your badge, but I don't like having a bunch of stuff on my badge. So, I keep it in my bag, um, and if I need it, then I'll take it out, or I'll put it in my pocket. That way, I can kind of, like, write or whatever. Because depending on what pot I'm in, depends on if I can bring my bag with me or not. Um, because we have eight different pods I don't know if I've told you at work and I work in one through four which is the level three level four pods also has like a complex care pod in that as well which is kind of pick you it's where the bigger kids go who still need ICU level care um so yeah I can take like my bag there but for example in like our level two kind of pod which is like level three level four i can't bring this because i can't bring it where like the isolates and all that stuff is and then lastly i have my pin light which i again have had this since nursing school if it ain't broke don't fix it it still works and everything um and it clips to my pants if i need to a lot of times i will have it there if i'm wearing like a scrub top which i don't wear usually then I will have this kind of like right on there um, in the front pockets. And this helps me. Obviously, I'm not doing like eye exams on the babies because some of the babies literally still have their eyelids fused. They haven't opened up yet. So um, what I will do is like I finally get to see where the line placement is for like a central line, like a umbilical line. Um, and the marks are really small. I can see that. Or if I need to check where an OG tube, an NG tube is. And baby tubes are super tiny. So you can't necessarily see the marks of where it is and the number of where it is. Um, so just to check placement, a lot of times I will use this. If it's dark and I don't want to turn on the lights and I need to see, does this baby have like a bruise or, um, you know, something like that then I can kind of shine this light on it and then I can see it. Um, then a couple things that I don't have in here right now, but I I don't really have a lunchbox, but I will put those things kind of just in my bag because it fits. And then um, also too, I usually use like things I can just warm up at work or I have a salad or something. And when I get to work, I will just stick it out, label it, put it there. And then um, I'll have something to hold like my silverware if I don't have it. Or I will use plastic silverware just because it's disposable and easy to use. And then I will also have my, um, I don't know what you call it, my jacket. But it's like the, there's a specific name for it that I can't think of right now. I'm going to brain fire. A fleece whatever yeah so i think that's what it's called a fleece basically the one that doesn't have like a hoodie or anything zips up it's warm you know what i mean all the nurses have it i will have my fleece um usually i'm wearing it but if i'm not wearing it then it will kind of sit across my bag just because these bags are open they don't have any zippers or anything and it'll help just like close it up 
um and then i also have my wallet which i don't have in here right now but um i have my wallet as well just in case i need it and that is about all like like i said i'm minimal i'm not bringing too much of extra stuff um one thing i forgot is airpods i have my airpods they're not in here right now i took them out but yeah so that's everything i will have in my bag um uh, again this is the bog bag i got it from dealers i think you can get it from other places as well but it makes a great work bag found it on tiktok you know all the tiktok girlies have it and um yeah so if you guys enjoyed this video again don't forget to please like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys in my next one